the same. Like they were, they look exactly the same. Oh, hi, people. Yeah. So what? All, I enjoy think it. Our they love the abuse. viewers appreciate it. Yeah. Have we crossed the one million viewers <laughs> yet? <laughs> yeah, was didn't you know? We did that like yesterday. We had a party yeah. and everything. Oh, nice. It was crazy. Yeah, that that's why people I'm kept here stopping me right now. stopping me at the street <laughs> and say like, uh, "Hey, I know your voice from somewhere. <laughs> you're the guy that turns into a bear, right?" Yeah, you're the bear, aren't you? <laughs> <You're> the, <laughs> you play the accordion too, right? <laughs> <laughs> Do the bear thing, man. Come on, do the bear thing. <laughs> Hashtag no Ross left behind. That's right. Yeah. Don't yeah. That's, what they, that's what they say whenever he shows up anywhere. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're going to see that on the back of the hoodies and shit now. <laughs> you know what? I if may we, have to if we ever up. If we ever do release a hoodie or a shirt, first shirt's going to say Hashtag no Ross left behind. <laughs> oh, right. No. I don't know what's up. I don't know what the image is, but we're gonna squeeze it in somewhere. I'm and telling you, it's the, just gotta be. It's gotta be like remake, not remakes, but it's just gotta be plays on like vote for Roz and <laughs> uh, that Have one a... where like free little free free little Wayne, except it'll be a bear behind like bars. No, you need a picture. Uh, you need a picture of Roz's druid character morphing into a bear. And have it like the uh, yes, have it like the barat poster that, that says change. We need a gif yes. of him turning into a bear and immediately attacking something <laughs> on a sweatshirt. And then no, it but... turns into him being a cat. A gif a yarn. sweatshirt? Are you fucking serious? That would be amazing. <laughs> More to the point, he attacks everyone who's not wearing the sweatshirt. Are we talking about sweatshirts character. right now in 2015? Like those exist? <laughs> I'm talking about a sweatshirt that has a playable GIF on it. Oh, wow. That's that, a bomb. That, that, that technically does exist, but it's not very good. I don't care. Yeah. I, I thought of it, so I made it up. So fuck those definitely, people that thought totally. of it before me. Right. Fuck you, Sam, for ruining my dreams. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you're able to patent something unless you have the... Uh... Prototype in hand. Um, yeah. I wasn't patenting nothing. I, I called... I called onesies. Shenan I nosed it. I fucking nosed it, okay? Nose ghost? <laughs> that is a legally binding contract if you nose it. Right. I thought you were going to say the legally binding contract of licking it first. No, nosing it. You don't know what nosing is? Like, I nosed my seat. My germs contract? Or I nosed my arm, or my, uh, an idea, you know? You know what? Uh -huh. I think we are a great group to be playing Cards Against Humanity. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know about that one. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> yeah, I'm not super into it. Not only that, but I don't know if uh, y'all can handle my humor. You really uh, gotta be able, you gotta yeah. be within company of those who get your humor. We can get your humor, I bet. I don't think you can. We'll we just put that out there right now. Okay. Why? Is it dark? No. So. Just Actually, I do love dark comedies. They're Some of my favorite comedies are dark comedies. Like, have you ever seen Choke? Choke? Yeah, that's a great movie. No, does, uh, that's a dark comedy. Does um, Final Destination count as a dark comedy? Uh, that's more like a... I like think it should, yes. Yeah. Like... When when I feel depressed, I just watch uh, Final Destination Five. Holy yeah. shit! Man. I think the first one they were serious about, but then like later on, I think they just gave up the fucking part. Yeah, they just wanted money after that point. Yeah, but I guess like, like whatever. It, like, it, it doesn't help that the uh, the main actor wouldn't come back for the second one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but it's really yeah. obvious they don't take themselves seriously. Which is oh, yeah. actually kind of cool. All right, we actually just passed the minute mark of when we should have started, so let's get started. Cool. <laughs> uh, all right. So currently we have a cast of three. Let's take turns introducing ourselves, and someone will hopefully remember what happened and we we tell the story. Uh, Roz followed by Kim followed by Neko. Uh. 
So just tell the story of what happened so far. What happened last time? Yeah, who you are, character, and then you, if you want to tell us the background story, go ahead. Oh, um, I'm Faba. I'm a druid from the forest. I'm crazy. Uh, uh, what's the name of the ranger, Kimmy? Linway. Linway. Linway found me after she lost her friend Gore, who died like he got exploded by some bandits. <laughs> It's still yeah, like stagger of explosion, yep. Ross. Stagger of explosion. He stabbed it in there and it just blew up. He got stabbed right through the heart and exploded. There was blood everywhere. You should have been there. Uh, and then Linway found me just wandering around the forest. And he told me, hey, you want to come and like, kill everybody? And then we killed everybody. And, uh, and from all of this killing, I... I got the skill that I can turn into a bear. Uh, and everything is kind of vague from there. I remember turning into a bear a couple of times, killing some more people. Uh, and then we went to the to see the wizard. <laughs> <laughs> also scared, like, yeah, scared off a prostitute. Yeah, I scared off a prostitute. The power of wizard of Republic City. Yep. And then, we, and then the wizard told us to come with him. Uh, and clear this dungeon under the under the city, and we went in. A couple of our parties left for some unknown reason. Oh, this some someone came and took them. And then we went into the dungeon and we fought a bone naga. And she almost killed our. Uh, I think it was a monk. Yeah. Yeah, like so, almost one hitter. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Almost one shot. Damn. But then the wizard, the wizard came and helped us, and the naga died. Uh, let's let's not let's not uh, play him up like he willingly did so. Yeah, it, it 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 was either him helping us or all of us dying. Yeah, there was some arm twisting that had to go on. Yeah. Fuck that wizard. Technically, uh, he did help. It just took a very long time for him to actually do anything. Yeah, but so now we're resting, and we hopefully go ahead and kill some more stuff. Probably the wizard. I imagine we're just waiting on uh, Linway to get back, right? Yeah, Linway will be walking in soon. Uh, Linway, introduce your character, and then we'll get to uh, Corey in a sec. I'm Kim Nix. I'm the babe with the power. What power? Power of voodoo. Who do you do? Power of the babe. Uh, uh, tss, uh, uh. <laughs> Y'all don't know that shit? Fuck, no. <laughs> terrible childhoods. Oh. <laughs> terrible ass childhoods. Anyway, Kim Nix. I'm playing Linway, the psychotic, chaotic, neutral, um. Uh, drow. Drow, cutesy, Ranger. fumbles all the time, makes really decently awesome plans, but they never turn out because I is always roll fucking sniper, warm. but is very clumsy the whole time? Yes. Bows break, I drop arrows. Anything you can think of. I've stepped in shit twice, apparently. Yes, you have. Um, <laughs> I don't know what happened after I left yesterday, but I'm going to assume... Your character doesn't know either, so it's fine. Yeah, I'm just going to say, I, you know, whatever. And, uh, you know, that's about it. And if nobody gets that reference, you had a terrible childhood. I forgot to send that to you the other night, by the way. Mm. Send what, what? Who to me? Use it or not, I don't mind either way. I just uh, made one up. Mm -hmm. Okay, Corey, go ahead. Your turn. Um, my dude's Memnon. He's a uh, tiefling um, rogue, although he uh, tells everybody he's a bard. <laughs> and, uh, well, I mean... Yeah, uh, yeah, out of character, y'all know, but yeah. So he's uh, yeah, that's big as hell. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, um, uh, God, what's your case? Linway uh, hired me on as a mercenary uh, because she was impressed by that, my drinking I don't skills, them by them thinking skills. It was totally the thinking skills. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> it was my gambling and drinking skills. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> my ability to stealthily piss in the corner. 
<laughs> but yeah, I'm tagging along. They're basically um, my boss at this point. Yeah. Okay, so if you look at the map, it actually is from the uh, from the side. So don't worry about it too much. Uh, it's really just okay. to indicate, like, because you, uh, the wizard does tell you, like, beforehand, like, this is a map, it's like a vertical look of the, uh, the layout of this dungeon. And he tells you that, um, he wants to go as far as he can. And then, um, if we need to return back, we will. I'm the skunk. Technically, you are. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, one sec, let me, let me drop something else in. So then we go as far as we can until he gets beat up. And then we kill him, and hopefully he's not a high enough level to have a contingency <laughs> spell. <laughs> I'll say that. Just... Technically, Allison is his contingency already. Yeah, he does have a level 2 month with him. I'm so not worried about a level 2 monk. She's quite month. strong. She is yeah. quite strong. <laughs> 20 strength is pretty impressive. I'm, I'm still not worried about it. <laughs> <laughs> but you have like 5 HP now. My idea still stands. And you're on our side. You're not on the monk's side. Are you, oh, are the you turncoating on me? The wizard, uh, the wizard healed her up, too. Yeah, but the wizard's only giving... The wizard's not even paying you. I paid you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why um, you're fucking... That's why you're my boss, not the wizard. Um, technically, he's paying all of you 20 gold, so he's also paying Corey. Yep. Oh, yeah, do I get to heal from resting as well? Um, yeah, we're gonna roll those die hard All right, now. cool. Um, you and Roz roll, and I roll for Allison. So I think she should be D8, right? Max. Yes, D8 for you. Give me something good. Oh, nice. get at me. Nice. Very nice indeed. I think that's going to max me out, actually. I yeah, I'll put max 15. Thousands at max too, then. So, I'm at max, but my bear needs to heal. Then go for it. So, yeah. Figured out mm -hmm. my ultimate goal in this game. What is it? I rolled five. To be the queen of goblins. Queen of queen goblins. Of goblin. um, queen of goblins. Yeah, you can do that. <laughs> I'm gonna rule all those little bitches. Um, let's see, uh, goblins primarily, they are technically oppressed by the orcs. So okay. you can do, you can do what you ever want with that. Image for the I want to become the bear who ate the world. Like You're gonna be my bear general. In the universe. General Bear. General bear. <laughs> <laughs> I wanna be like the like the D and D version of uh what's his face from the Marvel comics? Galactus, I think. <laughs> <You're> just, <laughs> just, a <giant. laughs> just a giant planet sized bear. Yeah, that goes around and eats stuff. Hey, if that's what you wanna do, I'm not gonna stop you. I, I need to find like a crazy wizard to turn me into yeah, you only need. Yeah, you need a large point. plus uh, permanency. Yeah. We just gotta keep you alive long enough. No, you, uh, you have you a tendency have... of getting into really bad fucking spots. Okay, yeah, you just have. So, uh, Kimmy, you return the next morning or r roughly six hours later. As the wizard is continuing to examine the door, you come back. The party has Don't look made. Ain't done yet. What? Oh, like no, that's like a different. Like they went into a room, and within that room, yeah, the fight, and then now he's examining the door. Oh, I thought he was still working on the yeah. same door that I, when I second, left. <laughs> second door. I was like, did you just destiny these people with freaking Dinklebot? That's a reference I don't get. Really? Yeah, me neither. Damn it. Okay, so, uh... <laughs> That's another reason, reference. Richie I am left and player. did not come back. Do what? The for whatever reason, Richie left and didn't come back. He just said fuck it and went back bar. to the bar and drink. Yeah. He's a dwarf. I'm he sorry, Sam. I really can't hear you, man. Can you hear me now? Mm, it's not, a little bit better. Not really much. Can you hear oh. me now? It's a 
tad better. Okay. So, uh, the wizard is just about finished as he calls you over. Uh, does anyone have anything to say to this wizard, or you want to continue on? <laughs> um, Roz is gonna be our wizard talker. Uh, hey, so, so I think, Mr. Wizard, you you need to tell us like what you want to do now. All right, he explains to you that the the main goal right now is that he wants to go as far down as he can. It's gonna be like looking around, examining objects, and bringing back any anything that he finds that seems interesting. Uh, he tells yeah. you that you're free to collect whatever you find on there, but um, once you guys are satisfied with whatever valuables you find, or um, someone is gravely injured, you, he will uh, t will turn back. Oh, I guess so you're we, a nice guy. We can oh, yeah, see you cool. there and just go. Uh, what's that again? So we can leave you there, Mr. Wizard. No, he says I will be. I will definitely be going back with you, but we want to go as far as we can before we head back. <laughs> okay. Of course, the, f but, the further we get, the more valuables we can find. So you're just doing it for valuables. Um, <laughs> you will be paid for the battles you fight, but um, anything you find, it's yours to keep. Should uh, okay. I would prefer that you let me examine each of them, you know, just in case they should be cursed, of course. Raz. Oh. Raz. Yeah. Ask him if he's a heavy sleeper. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's just not <laughs> that's just, that's just all. Hey, hey by the really way, good. if I you were to rate how you sleep on a scale of killable to not killable. killable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wizard man, wizard man. So just for you. Uh, I snore really heavily, so when you sleep, you should better cast a sleeping spell on yourself. Good call. Good call. Uh, he tells you that I cannot cast sleep on myself. It doesn't really work that way. Uh, You're yeah. a druid. Yep, Let him I teach can. you how to cast it. <laughs> Put that shit on a scroll. I'll hook you up. <laughs> yeah, whatever he, he, he tells you now, if you're ready to go, I believe the door... <laughs> It's just about to open, and he, like, pokes a few things, and the door begins to slowly slide open. Alright. Okay. Um, you are greeted with the scent of mold and rotting... It smells, it smells like mushrooms. Lots and lots of mushrooms. Alright. I wonder what could be coming up next. Mushrooms, probably. <laughs> okay. I try to... I do... a nature check. As, like, to try and smell anything distinguished. Okay, so, I'll let one person do that. Who wants to do it? Bl he I'll wants do it. to do it. Yeah, let him okay. do it. Yeah. I'm just saying, <coughs> minus... <coughs> now, you, guess... do know, you do know that there, in fact, are, like, creatures and mushrooms and plenty of things that consume mushrooms. So you're looking at, like, large insects, possible, like, cannibalistic mushrooms or... Oh. At, uh, at worst, you're looking at humanoids turned into mushroom creatures. Yeah. I I was like, uh, sort, of like, sort of like The Last of Us. I turn to the party and say, I'll smell some crazy shit down there. I'm gonna ask him if it's from my coat. Nah. It's fire right. voice, man. Oh, <laughs> yeah, the, wizard, the wizard mentions your coat, though. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go down there. I know well, it tracks. wasn't my fucking choice to get it all gross. Alright. Uh, Tracks? He, he likes the light, light spell, and he asks if anyone has any torches. It seems to be quite dark down here. Bitch, I don't need I like torches. Torch. You see these eyes? Yeah, I can see just fine. I like a torch, but <laughs> I can't see fine. Wait a minute. I thought you were human, son. Who? I'm you. I thought you were human. Uh, Corey, he's a tiefling. Yeah, I'm tiefling. Even. We don't but know my that. My character doesn't know that. He, he doesn't know I'm a dude. tiefling? He has, giant, <laughs> he has gigantic horns coming out the forehead. Oh, right. Oh, I thought we, you were trying to keep a secret yeah. from us. <laughs> no, the fact that I'm tiefling is obvious. The fact that I'm rogue is not. He has red skin, smells like brimstone, and has gigantic horns, and probably oh, I didn't know all that. sharp, sharp barbed tail. Well, then, I just didn't, I just didn't care to notice then. Yeah, I got that fly-ass human tail going on. 
stare all the rays. Uh, okay. As you continue down Step the staircase, the uh, you're first greeted by a two-way direction. Either go left or right. A hot, long hallway. And they all roughly look the same. I'm gonna this is Google the hallway? This. Like here? Or can like, you explain where you, the map? Where you are right now, it's a hallway. Hold Either on. go left or right. Hold on. Like this, this thing? Like the thing where you're all, all four of you are standing. Oh, so we can go... Okay. It's left or right. Shh, shh, shh. Like, Hold on. I'm just Googling to see what Google tells us to do. Right. <laughs> like, you, I go left or right. You're praying to the great gods of Google. Yeah. <laughs> and um, Harvard God. answered. Harvard answered, and they're giving me a long dry trop of whether or not to choose left or right. So I choose left. Alright, you hit left. Far left or stage left? Stage left. Yeah, stage left. <laughs> There's a panda. And you just got <laughs> a panda. Okay. That's fine. When he um, leaves, as you walk uh, into the, uh, as you walk into the room, there are primarily just glowing mushrooms and moss along the walls. Uh, there does seem to be something moving at the far end of the far far end of this room, but the door door leading out is to your left, and one more door it. far next to the creature way over there. Lindbergh, what's your elf I see? Tiefling, I will give you one platinum if you go and eat one of the glowing mushrooms. <laughs> uh, my name's not Tiefling. I don't remember your name. <laughs> it was it's like Memnon, Memnon, the mind taker or something, right? Just, just Memnon. 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 Yeah, Memnon. But uh, no, I'm not. I'm not eating it. But but it's it is a platinum, son. That's fine. I'm okay. <laughs> I'll give you two <laughs> platinum. <laughs> <laughs> no, still not worth it. Oh uh, wow, you're you're out of character. Your rogue inhibition told you not to do it. <laughs> no, that was in character. I'm not gonna eat a fucking mushroom. I'm not here to die. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Um. Alright, uh, the wizard says there does seem to be something at the far end of the room. Um, you're the ones here to guard me. It's up to you if you want to head in there. How far away is the other side of the room? Uh, roughly, uh, it's supposed to be ten for feet. It is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, about a hundred feet in. That's a big ass room. That's a big I'm room, gonna... that's kind of the point. I can see what? 120 feet in the dark, so what is there? Oh, you see it. Okay, yeah, it seems to be a creature made of mushrooms. It's a human mm. shape. It might have, like, infested a person or something. There's, there's just... a shroom dude over there. Yep. Shroom dude. Shroom dude. Shroom dude. Shroom dude. Shroom dude. Uh, do you think I need to turn into a bear before we face it? I don't know. I mean, why What's would you not turn into a bear? I mean, I, I I always figured you'd just turn into a bear whenever, <laughs> for any. No, reason. I have only twice a day, like okay. twice uh every rest. For how long? Uh, I don't really know. <laughs> I need to check it. Uh, it's indefinite. He can just stay in that form. I can stay a bear. He can just stay. Really? A bear. He can just. Stay I didn't a, know that. He can totally stay a bear. Then why don't you just hmm. stay a bear forever? Yeah, all the time. Okay, because when, so he, I... when he goes to sleep, he automatically turns back. Oh, well, yeah, that's yeah. fine. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to turn into a bear until we get into combat. I guess uh, I'm going to shoot it. No, no, I'm going to... I'm going to walk Roz, down I'll let and... you take this one. You take the lead on this one. I'm yeah, just going to ready go, in action. I'm, I'm, Hang on, wait, I'm, wait. I'm, before they're doing that, can I slink to the back and uh, do some bardly hiding skills? You Pussy. <laughs> uh, yeah, she can. I'm gonna, go, go, I'm gonna go two strings up. Is what I tell them. You know, I've been give feeling very subject. inspired by your music. <laughs> you haven't even heard it, Darren Bell. Just get ready for it. Yeah. Uh, Corey, if you really want stealth, it. go ahead and give Come me stealth check, and we'll, you'll be in the back, holding, All right. holding action. All right. Okay. So, uh, I'm gonna... give me anyone who wants to take the initiative and go first. They go first. Gonna... Everyone else, I'm... roll initiative. Uh, okay, I'm yeah, gonna go first, you. and I'm asking uh, Linway to cover me. Okay, Linway, right, roll I'm the shoot. shoot. And then move. 
Rod's going first, so you're gonna roll to see whether or not he'll, he'll go first after him. I don't know, he, I'll let him go first. Okay. Uh, I'm talking about you or that thing. Mm. Oh. So I need Can to roll initiative? No, not, yeah, not you. You're going first. Okay. You're going in for a surprise attack. Uh, surprise. Corey, we're gonna have you... You can either just go whenever you want. But it has uh, to, would have to be afterwards, because you already took your turn to, to stealth. Yeah. And this thing, uh, you won't know until it happens, so... Go ahead, Roz. You're first. Uh... Let's see, what's my stealth check? One second. Stealth, really low. Oh... Uh, I'm gonna try and sneak on him anyway. Go ahead, no, I think I you just... can do it. Huh? Go ahead, you can give it a shot. <laughs> Fail. Okay, Roz, you, you stumbled your way there and the creature notices you. You no okay. longer have a surprise. That's that's when I'm gonna shoot it. Okay, Roz, you get into roll initiative to see what happens. I uh, rolled yeah. 15. 15. You, in fact, do hit. Roll your damage. I'm gonna uh, do my Colossus Killer, and I'm gonna roll two of these bitches. I don't think that's how that works. Why not? I think it's any time you hit something that's at less than max hit points, you just add a D8. I don't think it's a skill that you actively use. Hmm, well that's an 8, because I get plus 3. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's okay. So then as long as it's not at max health points, mm -hmm. I can add an extra die 8. Mm -hmm. If you if you hit him after he's been taken below, I think, right? Let me go back up uh, to let it. Me look, bring, yeah, sure, let me bring I have it in my character sheet, don't worry. Sure, what does it say? Um, class. If it's it below, says it's a Colo it's uh, Colossus Slayer. Yeah. Your tenacity can wear down the most potent okay. foes. When you hit a creature with a weapon attack, the creature takes an extra 1 die 8 if it's below its hit point maximum. You so can yeah, deal it, this cannot be the it cannot be the first attack that hits it. Yeah, it's it's for prolonged battles. Yeah, so yes. from, from here on, you can, but... The first, first one I can't. Yeah. Gotcha. Well, it took eight. That's totally fine. It took eight damage. Uh, Roz, I need an issue from you, and I then five. Yeah, it's go, it's gonna go. Yeah. I got five. You, you got a five. Okay, then you're definitely going last. Yeah. Um, it moves towards Kim. Well, actually, no, it moves to Roz because you're closer. Yeah, I'm closer. Uh, and it misses. Nice. Dumb freaking <laughs> mushrooms. Roz, are you in bear form or in regular form right now? Human form. Bear. Okay. Um, Actually, no. What's your AC then? My AC is high, higher than my bear form. Oh, I left roll 20 again. Okay, yeah, amazing. if you're higher than, yeah, it's, it's fine. No, Roz left behind. That's what <laughs> I heard. Wow, that's really annoying. Okay. Uh, Kim, your turn, and then it, the spore feature, followed by Roz, followed by Corey, whenever he wants to join in. Join oh, no, in. I got, I got, I know what I'm doing. Okay. So, Kim, you're going first. Yeah, my Zero. AC is 14. <clears throat> your AC is 14? Okay. Yeah. That's the wrong die I rolled. Yeah. Oh, I I am um, moving and stuff, right? Uh, yes. Actually, right. no. Technically, yeah. You can be I, you can be as you can move. Uh, what was it, half movement speed if you want to stay in self. All right. Well, yeah. I just wanted to be there whenever he starts attacking Roz. Well, yeah, I rolled then, a sixteen, yeah. so I'm pretty sure I hit since I hit with that fifteen. Uh, yes, you hit. Dan. Okay. So well, it's a hit. That's what matters. Yeah, and it's still seven points. Yeah, that's still fifteen total. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's still standing. That, that's fine. I figured it would it be. Okay. I'm not wasting any spells on this thing yet. Not unless it gets a little hurry. Roz, you're a hit. I'm hit. <laughs> yes, no. you're a hit. 
How much? We're about to find out. Okay. Can I interrupt him attacking, or do I still have to wait? Um, you should have declared that before. Oh, I didn't know you were rolling to hit just now. I was waiting for you to say that, and then I was going to declare it. Yeah, it already happened. You were, like, That's you fine. Before, I'll wait. If you want to, like, specifically, like, deflect the attack, you should have done it, like, directly before I, before it's turn. Alright. I did it. Okay. I got it now. But yeah, if you want to do that next time, you can. Yeah, no, that's good. Okay, uh... But I'm just gonna go after his turn now. You take eight. Eight? Yes, you take eight. Okay. Okay, uh, Allison is going to move in now. Hit. Five. Actually, put plus seven. She hits. <laughs> yeah, I think that's landing. Uh, what's the damage on her scythe thing? Uh, it's a D four. She's got a scythe. She has a sickle. Four. Nice. Plus five. Eight more damage. Okay. So that's twenty three damage currently. Alright, I want to bodily backstab him. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You can definitely get behind him. And I'll let, <laughs> you, do, I'll let you do it. You still have to roll the hit. Go for it. Mushroom people have vital organs? <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually, no. Let me double check that. You can still do it. There's nothing, nothing in the game that you can't. So, you do it. And, like, technically, it probably does have vital organs. It's humanoid shaped, so... It's, Definitely something in there is protecting. Yeah. You. Uh, roll your damage. That's crazy. You level two. So I think you have a two d six, right? Uh, oh, I didn't read it for what I do when I get to level two. I didn't think I'd get there that much. I can go check. Um, unless it indicates it, it'd still be one d six. And Raj, you go last. It's my turn. Yeah. Once Corey's done rolling his damage. Uh. Oh no! It's scrolling too fast. Go back. <laughs> Don't you hate that? Ah. Uh, no, nah, at second level, it's still 1d6. Okay, go for it, man. Oh, that means I'm only doing a d6? No, plus your dagger, man. Oh, okay. Oh, got, hang on. I forgot what my dagger damage plus, is now. Uh, d4 plus d6. What about the dexterity modifier? Yeah, do I have oh, the dex yeah, mod plus, plus your dex modifier. Alright, and that's 3. So, so D4, D4 plus, plus 3 plus D6. And hopefully that works. I don't know if it will. I, I was just going to do them like this. Got D6. Uh, that's total more damage. That is 35 damage. It's still standing. Roz, your turn. I'm gonna take the form of a bear. Mm -hmm. And double attack. Uh, yes, you are in melee range. You hit. <laughs> you hit again. <laughs> uh, so the bite is the 8 plus 4. The claw is 2d6 plus 4. Roz, give me a constitution check for you biting a poisonous creature. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I don't know why it didn't occur to you. Uh, I don't care, I'm a bear. I eat anything. I don't care, I'm a bear. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I should be the I'll name of this If you roll one, you might have just screwed yourself over so badly. Oh, no. Nah. Is the poison damage goes to my human form? Just, just make a roll, man. Make a roll. It's gonna be a one. Okay, uh, yeah, you take you take damage. Uh, let me roll it for you. I did twenty five damage though. And that one hit. You take six damage from the poison. You did twenty five damage in one hit. Yeah, ah! as a bear, yeah, he did. I was feeling super impressive with my twelve. <laughs> yeah, Roz, you, 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 yeah, you tear this thing in half, basically. 
Oh. You, like, He's just sitting there with like the big derp. Like, totally worth. On sure. <laughs> totally worth the six damage. Exactly. How much, how much health does your bear have left? Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Yours. Yeah, you're pretty good. So, uh, everyone else, you should be fine. There's no role for constant. It's basically because Rosalie bit into a poisonous creature for whatever reason. <laughs> uh, the wizard, he like he was going to take action, but he never got around to it. Sure, uh -huh. sure he did. Yeah, I just want to shoot him a look and be like, "That's about Bardly maneuvers." <laughs> I'm uh, going to see no Bard like me. He does. Uh -huh. He does at some point mention like, "I only do. I only have so many spells per day." <laughs> I'm gonna yeah. stay at uh -huh. my bear form and take a I'm uh, right take a bear. spell to heal. Alright, so use that one of your little one spell slots to roll a D eight to heal. Right. Two. two. Yeah. Your bear form heals two points. Um technically you can you can use all of them if you want. <laughs> I'm gonna ride think... I'm gonna ride you think... rise and, oh. and heal you with my love. <laughs> I come with that sexual. <laughs> How much would I roll for love heal? Um, roll a d20, and if you roll a 1, I'll let you heal 1 point. <laughs> Actually, no, Kim, you rolled a d20, and if you get a 1, he heals 1 point. If I don't get a 1? If you get a 1. Uh oh. What if I get a 20? Nope. <laughs> Damn it. Alright, uh, the wizard examines the creature. Um, this thing seems to have a person inside of it. Person? Um, like he's slowly removing the like the mushroom in case Ew, the dude. person. And you better wash your hands before you. Literally, oh. There's literally a person on the inside, and Roz, you just bit off his head. Ah! Oh, <laughs> you're so cold, Roz. Cold. <laughs> yeah. Cold as ice. Okay. Roz. <laughs> You're my favorite, my favorite person ever. <laughs> well, favorite bear ever. <laughs> yeah, you're if I had a favorite bear, bear you would be it. Okay, you guys hear, you hear, you guys hear uh, noises coming from this hallway, from the uh, doorway over here. Uh, the sound of like several small feet moving around. Several small feet moving around. Yes, like the pitter patter of like dog feet. Like um, cobalt. Can I... Oh, yeah, I guess we already hear it, so I'll need to go listen at the door. Mm -hmm. Why don't you uh, go be a bard and, like, go investigate? I'll go <laughs> knock on the door. Okay, <laughs> you, uh, you knock on the door. And for a brief moment, the noises stop, followed by them all rushing towards the door. What are they? You... I'm, gonna, I'm gonna ask if there's anybody in there. <laughs> Who's there? Um, the wizard says that's getting pretty loud, and he is correct. The uh, the sound of whatever water is on beyond that door, it's getting louder, and there seems to be just lots of them on the other side of that. You wait. Uh, I'll get away is. from the door. Um, I'm ready in action. If okay. something comes through that door, I'm gonna shoot that shit. Uh, slowly, the door is really just knocked over, and one small creature walks out. What is it? Um, it tries to... it um, resembles a dog should its head be a mushroom. Like a mushroom should kobold? Should its head be a mushroom? Yes, its head as a mushroom. Oh, well, and well, a I'm few more bitch. are slowly walking out. That bitch is yeah. getting hit. Okay, you roll a hit? Yep. Uh, yes, you hit. Uh, roll your damage? Plus three. So you seven. You succeed in killing it. Woo! <laughs> and killing the dog. It falls over and releases a small puff of poisonous mushrooms. Um, is anyone adjacent to this creature? I scooted back from the door, so it ain't me. <laughs> um, not yeah, me. No, you see a I'm not there like either. a a uh, almost glowing puff of violet spore just from the body as more proceed to walk out of the room and are not heading in your direction apparently. Um, I'm but they are just... all slowly just walking out of the room. Are they just like I'm moseying just... around? Um, they don't seem to even notice you. Really? But more and more are coming from the doorway. I'm I'm really? I'm using myself as a cover for Kimmy while she shoots them from far, from a distance. Really? Shoulder shooting. 
What? I mean, I'm on I'm on top of Roz, so... Yeah, y'all yeah, need to oh. be fucking just raining dead from oh, them. You're just, oh, you're all just gonna ride Roz right now? I mean, I'm <laughs> on Roz. Um, does Allison and the wizard get, let, get on Roz also, no. or...? <laughs> they are not allowed. <laughs> okay. They can okay. fucking walk, damn it. All right. Kimmy, do your thing. I'm gonna hit yeah. something with my, my arrows. Do we even need to attack them? They don't seem to be doing anything. Yeah, I'm not that's really totally going. To, that's totally up to you guys. Do they seem hostile? They're just wandering around the room. Um, currently there are about 20 of them slowly crawling through the door. Like 20 okay. of them. I'm going to throw a rock at one of them. Okay. Roll the hit. Wait, I got it. And this is plus five. What? Or whatever, three. So 50. Okay, yeah, you, you definitely hit one. And have you ever seen Tokyo Jungle, that game? No. Okay, so basically what happens is they all immediately charge at the one that was hit by a rock. And the, that one dog was immediately torn apart into pieces. Fuck. I'm confused now. Um, let me Let me ask the wizard if he has any idea what's going on right now. He says in a very hushed tone, I think we should get out of here. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm fine with getting the fuck out of there. Little cannibal uh, mushroom kids. Before we go, I want... Uh, can I roll nature to see if I know what these creatures are? Go ahead. No. No, you... Wait, you, got, you don't <laughs> know. Something along these lines. I just gotta check my uh, underdark ability thing. Oh yeah, you should know something about this. Well, here's something cool. Difficult ter terrain does not slow our group. We can't become because lost of... except by magical means. Mm. I'm glad that's relevant to the current situation. And um, but I am gonna roll knowledge nature. And I want to ask the wizard if you have any uh, fire spells. Uh, the wizard is pretty much backed up to the other doorway, which I actually forgot to mark, but it leads to the uh, lower one over there. That's a lot. Um, yeah. Let me draw it. There should be a doorway technically here to here. So wait, if I just keep hitting them with the rocks, they'll just tear each other apart, though. Um... Let's see, you're from the Underdark. Um, these seem to be... Whatever... You th it's basically a parasitic type of spore. They've infected some creatures. You don't know where all these dogs came from, but they have infected a dog, and they seem to be attacking whatever makes noise. Hmm. Okay, doggy. Well, I'm just gonna throw rocks at them until they kill each other. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get away from him and sneak over towards the wizard door. That's a 17. Okay, so if you really want to do that, I need everyone to roll a stealth check, and we'll just see how it goes. Uh oh. Do uh do I have any disadvantages of bear? No, you won't. But you're rolling stealth as a bear. Uh, Corey, you pass. Uh, I think my bear form actually have better stealth check than, uh... Pasty dodgy on the left hand side. Than my human form. Well, what, what is your dex as your bear? Uh, let me find my bear. Giant. Uh, Kimmy, I'll need one for you also. Uh, can we just say my last roll right there? The one that I just rolled was the stealth check? Oh, okay, no, that's My fine. dex is 10. So, I have just a net, just a d20. Yeah, d20. So it's 17 plus whatever my ridiculous thing is. That's totally fine. Oh, I failed. Roz, you... Kimmy's just busy throwing rocks, and you you managed to, like, scratch your claws with the floor, and you were immediately attacked by five of them. Oh, shit! Yum! Uh, three of them hit, and you take... I'll lower right now. 
slash r d4. Actually, 3d4. Well, so this could either be good or bad. Let's find out. <coughs> you take five damage. Uh. Uh, give me a constitution check to not scream in pain. To not what? To not scream in pain. Uh, my... Oh, shit. <laughs> I gotta like turn up my Skype volume or something. I cannot hear a damn thing. Well, can everyone else hear me or what's going on? I hear you just fine. And yeah, nine. it might be you, Kim. Um, I mean, I have my volume all the way up. I don't know then. Uh, one sec, Roz, because you. Okay, no, you passed. It's fine. For whatever reason, they uh, they weren't able to hear you. Mm. Okay, uh, Roz, give me a stealth check to. Back away from the five that are like directly adjacent to you. And Kimmy, just roll me uh you know roll me a D ten and we'll see we'll say that's how many you've managed to get killed. Okay, Raj, you're gonna take more damage in a moment. Kim, D ten. Yeah, you you cleared up nine more of them, just like throwing rocks so they kill each other. Yeah. Roz Can I fight back? You can, would you like to? How many are there? Um Um there was like eleven, and there's still more, like one or two, walking out of the door as as you uh, as you stick around. Oh, I if, thought there was like a shitload of them. If um, I'm going, would you like to go into the room and find out? Uh, no, not until we clear everything out. Yeah, not until we're better off. Yeah, there's a few more like coming in as the as the more noises more noises being made. If if a thunderclap, will they like get confused <laughs> because of the loud noise? Uh, thunderclap creates an extremely loud amount of noise. Yeah, and there's... And will party deal damage to everyone in the party just by this sound. Because we're, we're in a closed <laughs> space. Yeah, um... Also, Kimmy's right directly on top of you. Yeah. <laughs> I would totally not want to get hurt. <laughs> or be shot five feet into the air. Okay, so I'm not gonna fight back. Although I want to. Well, I'll, I'll throw a knife over at him. If there's not a fucking a thousand of them, I'm not worried no, about they're it. they're gonna poison me. They release poisonous spores. Oh, yeah. They're not on you, though. They're... If adjacent, I guess. There's five directly adjacent to them. Right. You know what? You know what? I'll, I will throw a knife, but I'll throw it at the wall uh, away from him. Okay, then you technically lose a knife, because you, I that's, doubt you're ever gonna go back to get it. That's fine. I can throw a knife. <laughs> okay. If you're if you're literally aiming for the wall, just roll me a d20 and don't get a one. Throw a rock. Not your knife. Oh, I want it to be loud. I want it to bang around. Yeah, go for it. All right. Well, you succeeded. Okay. Wow. So what what actually happens? Because apparently you did quite well. Is you your dagger flings and hits the wall and doesn't actually clink clang to the ground. And the dogs just keep jumping at it. And it stabs into the wall, and each of them are dying as they jump at it. Get at me. Get at me, son. <laughs> <laughs> Within a few moments later, um, there's literally like like 11 of them just dead after jumping at this dagger stabbed into the wall. Um, okay, okay well, so I you guys... Pull out a lot of them are dead, and now there's a small plume of almost radiated, yeah, I was just like, about to say, violet, I'm, violet purple smokes moving towards you. I'm just about to say, I'm pulling out a rag and tying my face. Okay, I'll give you a disadvantage check on your constitution. Roz, what do you do? Um, hold my breath. Okay, you hold your breath. That doesn't work. Roll your constitution check. <laughs> uh, can we anyone from you too? You have it, have it at advantage. Uh, Raj, you pass. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm still backed up to the door with the wizard. Is he at the door yet? Um, yeah. You're the two of you and Allison are at the door because she would have to be in melee range. She just wouldn't do that. Okay. Uh, Kim, I need one from you because you're you're still riding Roz. And yeah, you pass. No problem. Woohoo. You actually you feel quite fine actually. 
That's right. Get at me. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. There are more in that room, but they don't seem to be coming out for whatever reason. That's fine. I want to know what's in that fucking room. Yeah, I'm throwing rocks at them until they kill all of each other. <laughs> you're just going to keep doing that. Okay. Um, I think, yeah, at this point, you're just rolling checks, Kim. Roll I mean, me, I'll uh, take my time yeah. on it. Okay. You guys take your time. The wizard is... The wizard is curious, but he, like, assumed you want to leave. So he just, he sits down, says, um, so how long do you want to be here? As long as it takes. How many uh, of them are left? All right. Um, he says, okay, we can do this. Um, he wants to examine one of the bodies and is going to stealth his way over and grab one. Let's Who see. is? The wizard? The wizard. Unless let, let me put my hand on his chest and I'll tell him I'll grab you one. Okay, just give me a self check, man. I'm pretty sure you're not gonna fail. Uh, Kim, just roll me, roll me two d10s, and that's how many you managed to kill. Hey, okay, yeah, Corey, you're fine. You're you had a very yeah. grab one of the bodies. Nine. Okay, you killed nine more. So um, how many are left? You don't know. They're still walking out of the room. Hmm. Why don't you just throw a torch? Oh wait, we can see inside the room, can't we? You yeah. just barely see into the room. But they have dark, like, dark vision. 120 feet, sucker. Yeah, Kim, you can see into the room, just like, at an angle. Yeah, I'm sure. I wasn't gonna, th I wasn't thinking that I could see all of the room. Yeah, yeah there's, like, mm, there's, like, five more you see, just, like, right there. The room itself seems to be been cleared out quite a bit. Fucking A. Hey, uh, Bard Boy, why don't you go in there and actually work? Hey, fuck you, I just killed 11 in one hit, so uh, yeah, come he did. get back to me after you do something like that. <laughs> Listen, I've been doing all the work. <laughs> yeah, no, you're right. I, I totally didn't fucking stealth bard attack somebody. You didn't do shit, I didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so the wizard I want to use my keen wizard, sense yeah. of smell to try and distinguish how many are left. Okay, roll a constitution check, because you just sniffed more poisonous gas. Oh, come on. You're just trying to sniff a room with poisonous gas in it. I don't know what to tell you. This is true. Uh, you take damage. I already resisted the poison once. Yeah, but now you're sniffing it. That kind of undoes the fact that you resisted it. Take okay. four more damage. Fuck this damage. <laughs> Does it look like the spores are fade away or are they just lingering? They are, they're starting to cling to the walls. Alright. It's like, they don't stay in the air for, like, for a very I long time. say, wizard, you should just burn all this stuff. So, um, it says if you really want, I do have one torch. Yeah, start burning stuff. Okay, he likes the torch, and after that, I won't like to throw it. Ah, uh, fuck it, I'll do it. I'm the one that's got that skill. Go ahead, give me, give me a check check. Okay, well, you succeed. Team. It is just a torch. You land it, and the spores catch on fire. Woo. Um, yeah. So we'll, we'll see what happens then. Okay, you kill the five. You hear a couple screeching sounds, and after about five minutes of burning, there doesn't seem to be much left in here. Cool. Yeah, that's right. So the so we didn't see that the room, right? Uh, you think so? There's nothing. Uh, there's nothing walking out of there. Can I go and grab my knife then? Um, it's literally covered in like corpses of burnt mushroom dogs. If you want it. Yes, yeah, my lucky knife. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Okay, you you find the knife and it is covered in that violet, that glowing violet purple kind of thing. If you want it, you still want it. Oh yeah, I can wipe it off. Okay, you wipe it off. Yeah. I'm gonna hang on to that one. I wanna fucking. That's my lucky one. Mark it somehow. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna put it. Just declare that you use it and see what happens. Yeah, hang on, let me see. Uh, you notice that the wizard's literally dissected the dog and. I am interested in what he's doing, but first I'm gonna carve uh, a smiley face into the uh, into the butt of that knife. <laughs> nice. Okay, so what he what he's basically done is he dissected the dog, 
and has literally taken the part that had that was the actual mushroom and seems to be taking out the uh, the spore sack and other parts of it, stacking them in like containers and seems to be taking it with him. He also indicates that had the dogs don't seem to have eyes, not functioning eyes anyway. Uh, I would say let's check out the head of the kid that we killed, but it's somebody who's fucking got it in their stomach right now. Yes, Rod sort of bit <laughs> right through that thing. <laughs> Don't you make fun of my bear. <laughs> Don't make fun of my faba. Okay, does anyone actually walk into the room? Uh, I want to... I want to look in, but I don't want to just go charging through the fucking doorway. Right, you look in. Uh, I'm trying to send the sneaky person to go do the sneaky stuff, but he's yeah, like, I'll, sure. I'll, he's back sassing me. Give me a I'll check. I'll hardly stealth check the door. Go ahead. <laughs> okay. Not great. You, you try to stealth, and what actually happens is you, as every step you take, just like you crunching <laughs> like, or crispy mushrooms the whole time. <laughs> it's definitely not stealth. Uh, when you actually make it to the door, um, there is a more gigantic, it's a gigantic version of everything you've seen, three attached to the wall. Ooh. And like, thing, it's dead now, but it looks like a dog. Dog head and the rest of it is a giant mushroom. So I'm the only one that sees it, right? It's, you're the only one that sees it. Can I look for anything of value in the room before they get there? <laughs> uh, there does seem to be a corpse that might... I yeah, I want to look at it. Okay. Is that perception or? That's gonna be an investigation. Investigation. Okay, let me find that. Get out of here! You um, you don't see anything on the body. Two. Stay. You yes. just you see nothing. You see a body, and there's like a, there's a couple rocks around, but you don't see anything that you would be interested in. Uh, um, let me, technically, let me, you you already rolled, so you you have no interest because apparently you saw nothing just now. Uh, I didn't see the body. Like, what's going on in there? Like, you saw the body, but like right. I want to yell out. It's like, look, guys, there's a body in here. I didn't want to inspect it for any valuables because you're the boss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going anywhere. I got. Oh, I'm a bear now. So, <laughs> yeah. Unless you want, unless you turn back into a person and undo your thing, you're gonna have yeah. to stay a bear form. No, I'm riding you right now. I don't want to hurt I'm you back. But uh, <laughs> okay, let's... Kim, what do you do? I'm a, let's. I'm a mush my bear towards my faba bear towards the uh, door. <laughs> uh, I don't want to go. You don't want to go? Ross, Damn it! Ross, 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 move. Just remember that I gave you first digs. <laughs> then, then I'm gonna go myself. <laughs> okay, uh, Kimmy, you see what is essentially a dog strapped to the wall. It's seems to be wrapped in mushrooms, and there is a small corpse to the adjacent to it. Huh. Humanoid corpse. Yeah, that's the one I told you about. Well, I guess I search it as well. Investigation whatever my, check. Whatever my investigation is. Wow. Is it a negative? Because that would be amazing that no one finds anything. <laughs> Okay. Well, it was a negative, but I got eleven. Hey, yes, you succeed. Uh, you Aha. find you find a small sack. Ooh, I sacks. bet you did. Yeah. <laughs> um, that the shit. contents are just uh, ten silver and a, a potion. It it is marked, but because of how old it is and the fact it's covered in mushrooms, you can't tell what the uh, label says. Uh, I'm a bard. I can appraise things. You can hold on to the bottle and you can have the silver. The silver's yours. That's ten silver. It's all yours, buddy. And a bottle of unknown, hey, you. Of unknown cool. contents. Alright, cool. Uh, and, it uh, seems to fizz. If you shake it around, it bubbles a little bit. Oh, that doesn't sound good. No, it's probably just cola or something. Or it's old. <laughs> it might just be old. Maybe it's fermenting. Maybe it might be alcohol, too. You don't know. Oh. Maybe it's the stuff that makes you turn into a mushroom. I do not want to turn into a mushroom. And please don't trip and fall with it. And then I suggest you not eat anything. The wizard the wizard seems to be content with what he found. Um, would you like to continue further? Oh, well, yeah, we do. Alright. Then, yeah, you wait, continue. Wait, wait, wait. The only time I want to go back is if we're at 50% health. What's everybody's health at? I'm full. 
I have... Everyone I, but I, Roz is full, I think. Yeah, I have uh, 18 yeah, on my beer. He's been tanking it. Yeah. Okay. Well, this time... I, oh, go ahead. No, no, you go first. I was going to say, can I insight the uh, the bottle, or is there a roll I can see to try to determine what it is? Uh, it's appraisal... What, what would appraisal be? So there's an NAK ending for is check. Because you said you want to use appraisal, right? 